how to create a typewriter effect on Wix Studio. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how easy it is to set up a typewriter effect onto your Wix Studio website. It is very easy and very simple. All you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you are going to be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to head over your platform on Wix and also your website. Don't forget to sign in into your account then you are going to choose the website that you have. If you don't have a website yet, I highly suggest for you and recommend for you to create one with the help of the AI or you can choose a simple template. Once you are here on the website, we're going to add a CSS code. And this CSS code is going to be here uh, on the video description below. You're going to copy and paste all of these elements of the code. Then you are going simply to add it as an embed code. So we are going right there to choose our area and let's say that we are going to add it right there. So we are going to click on add element. Now from the add element, we have quick access and etc. We are going to choose only embed and social media. Make sure that you're going to select your embed code. We're going to drag and drop here the code into iframe like that. Then we're going to click on enter code. This is an iframe code. So we are going simply to paste the code right there. We are going to click on update and we are going to see here a writer or typewriter effect. As you can see here, I think we have two or three words. Here we have, I think, three words or three cities. And I'm going to explain to you how we can do that. So how we can change these words. So you're going to head over the code. We are going to uh, here, uh, scroll till the end. Here we are going to see the uh, type string. We have here type strings. And for example, as you can see here, we have New York. So we are going to put, for example, I'm going to change it to San Francisco. Like that. I'm going to click on update and I will let you see here the magic happen. So here we have London. And the third one, which was here, um, as you can see, it was um, New York. We've made it San Francisco. The same thing for Paris and London. You can go ahead and modify those and you can modify the pause time. And you need to make it even for the three type string. So here we have it. For the colors and everything, you are going to see here the color and then you are going to put it right away. Here we have the border right color and etc. So I highly recommend for you to let it as it is. If you know how to code or you know how to read the code, you're going to modify here the code and put, for example, a color or a code of another color. And here we have it. So you are going to make it right there a little bit bigger to show up the uh, everything so that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one